Hey everybody, what is up? Today I am looking at Eradicator. Developed by Accolade and published by Atari and Night Dive Studios. This came out originally in 1996, sitting on very positive reviews on Steam with only 64 reviews, mind you. But the people who posted the reviews seem to really love it because this is a classic boomer shooter. Now, uh, you notice in the demos that Looks it like plays I'll be adding the cost of a new ship to my price tag. Like a third person shooter, but you can switch between first or third, and I it's very odd. I don't know why you'd play third person, to be honest. Now we have three playable characters with three distinct um weapons and stats. But what interests me so they have different missions. So I did a little test record as Carmack. Carmack, however. Um, I want to test someone else out just to see if they uh, start in a different area. So we'll go with Dan Blaze, the cybernetic mining engineer. Power the converted Ixian mining base on. Gain access to the launch bay and satellite array. Use satellite array to jam Ixion scanners and shuttle and pilot to Citadel on Ixia. Okay. Whoa, the mine got hit by some kind of energy wave. Yes, okay, we do start in somewhere else. Interesting. Um... I will also say that you will definitely have to change the default controls. They are set to like old school, old school DOS box. So like arrow keys and control to shoot and everything. I've modernized a little bit with WSD and uh, jumping on space and mouse look. It's the basic ability to strafe because I do not know how you're meant to play on those default controls. I'm actually quite pleasantly surprised how this game plays. It runs runs quite nice. Um, graphically, I do like the style. Not so sure about the voice acting. Oh god, we've got platforming. That could be a problem. Uh, what have we got? Ooh. Ooh, it's very floaty. Very floaty. You move surprisingly quick. With the security on our turrets, we'll blast anything in sight. Okay. I like the creepy atmospheric music. So the story is, I think, uh, I'm not sure if it's the mines themselves or some planet yeah, ends up shut down the generator. being uh, yeah. invaded by a biomechanical threat who threatens to attack anybody who tries to enter. And they've set up some kind of shield or something that uh, stops people from leaving, I think. Oh, there we go, we've got the generator on one. A lot of destruction. That's also a nice touch. Not something you saw very much back then. Oh, that doesn't look too good. door I was at before, isn't it? Yep. Okay. Ooh. I'm not even sure that's meant to be. That's an arm. There's chests. Autopsy tank. Scans indicate alien organism. Okay. 
Quite impressive to have like interactive screens and stuff back. Well, maybe not. Oh well, nice little touch. Yeah, that's pretty much how I sleep on my bed too. Darts. Ooh, okay. So apart from the default weapon, I don't know if the other characters get the same weapons or not. Okay, little lift. Still no enemies apart from turrets, which is strange. Got a hammer. I think it's the back of this gun, to be honest, but... Sonic Shock. Hmm. Getting all the weapons. Detonation Mines. I'm digging it so far. But it's weird to go this long without an enemy. No. Launch by locked access only from the control room. Okay. Nation quarters. Cool, um, realistic level design too. Something that you didn't always see in, uh, older boomer shooters, where it was just nonsensical map design. Jeez, you do really move fast, don't you? I'm gonna go back to that lift. Where was that? Oh, that's right, that's locked. The uh, lift is on the side. Creepy. No. Hmm. All right. What are we doing next? Teleporter. Scanner array control. Coordinates input. Standby. Aligning dish. The shuttle. Their sensors could go online soon. Oh my goodness. Alright, I suppose I should be heading back to that shuttle. I hope this isn't how every level ends. Yeah, I'm going to go. No. No? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think I fucked up. This resetting. Okay. Would I just have to do it again? What was I meant to be doing here? No, no. 
What do you want me to do? Power the converter to exceed mining base. Use satellite array to jam scanners, find shuttle and pilot it. Oh, maybe I've missed a switch in here to open that shuttle room. Finger. That's what I was missing. Get in the ship. No. Okay, I guess I did it. Oof. Hmm. Okay. Infiltrate the facility. Shut down power to engage conduit. Locate and engage lift to subcomplex. Um, also surprisingly in-depth missions. That's something you didn't see back then a lot either. No, no. Oh, here we go. Robots. Hmm. What the heck is that? What an friend no. oh here's a friend nice it's a nice little touch Never date. No? Okay. Well, I've done a switch. No. Ah, never date. Weapon enhancement chip. Okay. Uh, I've got a conveyor belt. little maps to explore, though I do see myself getting lost. Ah, damn, I think I was meant to use those explosive barrels. Can I move them? Oh, I can. Nice. Force wall defense measure. I'm glad that was something I was supposed to destroy. That was a lucky guess. Yeah. The heck was that? Oh god, it's dark now. Very dark. next. So 
surveillance camera. I have no idea if I missed anything. I feel like I probably have. Oh, that's it. Okay. 15 out of 15 enemies. Zero secrets. If anybody's seen my um, streams, that's pretty much on par. <laughs> Destruction total. Hmm. And I missed a key card. 0 out of 10. A 0 out of 1 total 0. Hmm. Destroy three power conduits to disable the defenses. Access and destroy main CPU node interface and locate transport tube. The triple fusion. Um, what is that? Oh god. Hmm. Interesting. Um... I'm not sure what this thing's supposed to be. The shotgun or what? It's powerful. Ooh. Oh god. Platforming, not fun. Control room door, power restored. Is this one of the things I have to destroy? Haha. -ha. Doesn't seem like it. That could be something to destroy. Guessing it's protected. Um Hmm, interesting. But my only gripe with this game so far is the objectives can be a little obtuse. No. Ooh. Oh, maybe I don't want to destroy them. A rocket launcher. No, no, no. Hmm. He's very dark, cannot see thing. Invulnerable. Nice. No, no. No. Hey, yeah, also the force field should be knocked out now. Cool, cool. Ooh. 
New friend detected. that floors field. That one's still active. No. That's the elevator. Ah, here it is. Yes. Ah. Security beams deactivated. Cool, cool. friend. No. Hmm, strange. Well, now what? No, 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 no. Still missing a power conduit. I've only destroyed two. Hmm. No. Let's see what else I can find. Got me some items, but not what I was looking for. Oh, can I? Big jump. Oh, nice. Dead end. Okay. All right. Well, we've got some more items. As that does not help me with my predicament. Nothing else in here. And that's the thing again. Hmm, what am I missing? Better take out that computer core. Oh. Okay. What can I do with this guy? Seem like I can interact with anything, unfortunately. Hmm. Get a good look at our enemies. Ah, oh, this up here. I see.
Hmm, very strange. Well, that didn't help at all. Wait. Which security doors? Oh, that was it. <laughs> Problem solved. Ooh. doors off. CPU corridor power restored. Ah, shootable switches. Ah, force field. Oh, nope, not force field. High technology glass. All right, we still got one of these to do. Opening CPU, thank you. CPU alarm status off, good. Ow. Ceilings, if you no, I don't want that to one. No, I definitely don't want that. So dark. I can't see sheep. No. Oh my god, I really cannot see anything. Whew, there we go. Um, now is that force field. Oh. 
Excellent, excellent. Oh, there he is. Poor guy. Oh, you. Interesting. I don't know how I'm supposed to know that was there. I just got extremely lucky. Um, secret noise. Uh, what is this piece? It's just a whoa, hello. Whoa, nice. Probably not good against flying guys. Guessing that's it. So we'll quickly see what's in here. Oh. Oh man, I should have left one of those things, shouldn't I? Eh. Oh. I can't push these ones. Ha. Little buddy active. Activated. Little buddy. Oh, looks like up there as well. Damn it, why did I destroy that? Alright. Okay. Well, three out of nine, that's a bit better. <laughs> I will end it there. I can't remember what my name is. Mining guy. There we go. Um, <laughs> I'm thoroughly impressed by this. I think I remember the GOG version. Because GOG has that scoring system where it's out of five. So if you see something that's rated three or whatever, you're like, oh, well, it's not that good. Whereas Steam is very positive and it seemed to be full of all these positive reviews, but... Yeah, it's interesting. You gotta definitely, definitely get a different perspective. Um, all in all, I would call it a pretty good success. I could see me having fun with this. Pretty much up there with a lot of the other classic boomer shooters of the time. Um, graphically, well, I quite like the graphics. I think it holds up today. There are other boomer shooters that don't quite hold up as good as this. I love the atmospheric music and stuff. It's not bombastic or anything, but it's enough to get you going. Um, what else? The gameplay, I like the weapons. I do actually... Mm, I would have liked to have known. Just quickly... Yeah, so he starts with a completely different weapon. The clan of Tradan shall be made proud today. And I don't know if all your weapons are different. Much has been abandoned here. Don't know how long before we'd hit a new weapon. I kind of like this guy's default weapon too. Quite nice. Hmm, yeah, I'm not sure how long before we find another weapon. But no, that's quite a nice touch. And like I said, there's a lot of things that surprise me. Like the objectives. You didn't get many objective based um, boomer shooters back in the day. Uh, maps weren't too convoluted. 
like I said, the objectives, like trying to work out and guess what a power cell and all that can be a little bit obscure, but I didn't seem to struggle too badly. No, this is definitely a recommendation from me. Um, so with that, I will say like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you thought of the game, let me know if there's anything else you want me to cover, let me know how I'm doing, and I'll uh, see you guys in the next one. See ya! Thank you.